I'm the fastest dasher in my neighborhood. I'm the fastest dasher in my neighborhood. I'm the fastest dasher in my neighborhood. Which no customer can deny. <laughs> yes, sir. YouTube world, what it do? It's called dinner. As you can see, I'm sure. Woo! You see, it's thawing, it's thawing out a little bit right there, but it's cold out here, right? 21 degrees, not below. 21 degrees. That's that's freezing. You know what I'm saying? You can put food out here and it'll freeze. You feel me? Oh, shit. But um. I'm about to go uh, pick up my phone from Ben's real quick. Cause I'm not sure where my car is at. And then, and then, I might do a little bit of dashing. You know, a player like me signed up for DoorDash. I wanted to see what it was all about, you know. There's too many days and hours sometimes I just be sitting around with nothing to do. You wait no money. When I can actually be out there chasing money, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? So, you know, I ain't working for nobody but myself, you know, ain't nobody telling me to get up, go, all that. It's on my time. I know where I'm going. I know what I'm making. So, you know, that's all good too. I ain't, this is my very first dash though. So, I'm gonna start mine around four o'clock. That's in 15 minutes. That's peak hours, four or five around here where I'm at. So, yeah, y'all stay tuned. I'm letting my car warm up because it is cold out here. And then uh, I'm going to tap back in with y'all when I, uh, I guess, get my first order. So, stay tuned. We'll see what happens. All right, y'all. Hey, y'all. So, oops, let me drive straight. It is 5.30 and I'm doing my first dash. And my first dash is $12. With I think $1.50 uh, automatic on the pickup. So, it's my first dash, y'all. I am four minutes away. And then, I'll let y'all know well, y'all see when I pick up the order and everything. And I kind of tell y'all where I got to go and all that. So, stay tuned. It's nighttime, so let me turn off my inside light and get to driving. You feel me? All right. Let's get it. All right, YouTube family. I'm back. And I picked up three pizzas from Blackjack. One large, two smalls, and some breadsticks. So I got them in the back right now. And I'm headed three miles from the location. This was a $12 uh, guarantee. I don't know what the tip is. Like I said, this is my very first time doing this. So as soon as I find out what my tip is and stuff, after my first, after I push uh, complete, I'll let y'all know. You know what I'm saying? I just wanted to update y'all. Because I told y'all, you know what I'm saying? What time is it now? It's 5.42. So it was 5 something when I first let y'all know. So y'all stay tuned. Y'all know how I say it. Y'all stay tuned, man. This is Face Man TV. Oh, yeah. And while I'm doing this, make sure y'all smash that like button and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. You know what I'm saying? And, um,. I will definitely get with y'all in a minute. Let me, uh, I got five minutes to get to my destination. And, uh, that's when I tap in, back in with y'all. All right? Bet. All right, so. In a quarter mile, turn left on Aonita Street. It's old night and not old Nita. You know what I'm talking about? So we is about 
55 seconds away from there. Woo. About to pull up. So, uh, comment below if y'all do DoorDash and give me some tips and some advice on, you know what I'm saying? You know, I only talked to one person that does this and we sat outside for about five, eight minutes. He know, ran some some jewels Take to me. Next left on Aonita Street, then turn right on but, East uh, 61st place. Yeah, comment below. Let me know some tips and all that. Right now, my very first dash was 12 bucks. I don't know what the tip is yet because I ain't completed it, but I'm about to pull up. So, let's see where we at. I, you know, I know it's the thing Take about the next right on East 61st place. The destination will be on the left. I believe I'm going to a house. Oh shit. Oop, I was supposed to turn there. Back up. This is all live action, y'all. Your destination is on the left. The customer requested you leave the order at their door. They added the following instructions Leave at my door. Leave at the door. Okay. That's what I just did. Thank you. Thank you. Have a good one. Oh, you too. All right. Hey, man. Now, let me pull over here. Exit. Complete delivery. All right. Oh, so. Total trip twelve dollars. Base pay was three fifty. Peak pay was a dollar. Customers tip was seven fifty. Total twelve dollars. Oh, I thought it was the tip on top of the twelve dollars, man. Hold on, I got another one. But I am not going to accept. It is four dollars and seventy-five cent for seventeen items and six point two miles away. I will decline that. Decline. Too many orders. Bam. Cool. So on my money, as y'all can see, it says twelve dollars, right? At the top. I think y'all can see that. So I gotta go this way. Ooh. Okay. Wing stop. Nine dollars. I will accept that. Boom. And we head it off. Head north on Niagara Street toward East 61st place. Hey y'all. Head we south on Niagara Street toward East 61st place. We out here chasing the bait. Uh, uh. 600 feet. Turn right on East Shut the Avenue. Shut up. Damn. How many times you gonna say it? But anyway, we out here chasing that small right bag, you know what I'm saying? Avenue. But you know, small turns into big, you know what I'm saying? Especially if you chase it. But yeah. So we headed to Wing Stop. And then we're gonna go Continue drop that off. 60th Avenue for half a mile. So that'll be nine dollars. And twelve plus twelve is what? That's a, that's a dub. I only been out here for like 20 minutes. Hey y'all, we are at Wingstop. Go in here and pick up this order real quick. Be right back. All right, so uh, we just picked up a 30 pack of wings and um, we going nine minutes away. 3.4 miles, nine minutes away. The way I drive, we'll just make it seven minutes not saying i drive fast but you know 
I know I know the way around my neighborhood type thing. So yeah. Uh pretty cool, pretty cool. Um let me get on this road. Take the next left on East 62nd Avenue, then turn right onto Colorado 2 North. Drop this food. And you know another thing, y'all. I already know y'all dashes. Y'all be picking up this food and be hungry, man. This shit get y'all hungry. It's all good, man. I'm out here trying to eat a different way. You feel me? Let's go. All right, it's 6:05, and we pulling up to drop off this uh, wing stop. And it's another house, no apartment, and that's how I like it. Your destination is on the left. The customer requested you leave the order at their door. They added the following instructions. Leave at my door. Okay. All right, now this time I gotta take a picture of the order if they leave a door, so hold up. Took a picture. So, let me see what this is about. Tokyo Joe's. Nah. I need to get back on my side. So, we are at $21 in, I think, less than 30 minutes. I got out here. Damn, brakes squeaking this shit. There it go away. But, uh, oh, they got all these different ones at the bottom. Oh, seven miles, seven miles. What's this 3.8, though? That's what I want to know. All right, y'all, so I just accepted another order from Dairy Queen for nine bucks. Right around the corner from just where I was. Right on East. I am 0 0.9 minutes away from that location. And the drop off is somewhere around here at the same time. It's a five Continue mile. On East 64th Avenue for three quarters of a mile. It's a little five mile radius from the Dairy Queen pickup to the drop off, nine bucks. So that'll put us at, it is 616. We had 21, so that will put us at $30 even, right? Okay, okay. Now let me let me break down why I like this already to an extent. You don't have to put no money, upfront money for this. All you gotta do is have gas and a vehicle. You know what I'm saying? And only thing you're putting in is a little bit of your time, but you can choose to when you can choose when you wanna go out and you know get some money and you can choose your orders. So, it ain't been an hour yet, and I'm about to be at $30, and I guarantee within an hour In a or two, mile, turn left. I'll probably hit 50, you know what I'm saying, something like that. So, it's pretty cool so far, you know what I'm saying? I could just be sitting at home doing nothing, you know what I'm saying? But, I mean, hey, you can even... You can even even uh, compare this to Turo in a way. Say you got a car on Turo and it's going for turn left, then turn right. 
forty dollars a day. They get your car for forty dollars a day. They get two hundred miles limit each day, and they take percentage off the top of that shit. Man, you know what you're getting. You know you can go get as much as you want. So, hey, right now, Turo, I don't know. This Jeep might be out here getting some DoorDash money. Because you can call me the new Dasher, you dig? But uh, let me pull into this spot and go pick up this order from, oh, Dairy Queen. Look, I'm, I, ain't, I ain't never been over here to this plaza. I almost went in the wrong goddamn place. <laughs> what else, Dairy Queen? All right, we got the order. It's 622. Head west toward Ivy Street. Three minutes away. Nine dollars. Nine dollars. Three minutes away. Let's get it, y'all. I think y'all gonna like this, too. When I let y'all know how much money I made at the end of the night. Y'all stay tuned. I'll check in with y'all in a minute. All right, y'all. So my destination is here at Taco Bell. Somebody from Taco Bell ordered some Dairy Queen. That's crazy, man. That's crazy. Four fifty. Arrive. No, not pick up from Taco Bell. Hold on, what happened? Oh no, hold on, DoorDash. Oh no, where am I supposed to be going with this? Ah oh, shit. Hold on. No, I gotta go to her. Milwaukee. All right, y'all. So, uh, I'm back here at Taco. Feet, turn left onto Glanco Street. Damn. What the fuck? Oops. I'm back over here by Taco Bell. I already did that order that fast. So, um, now I can go over here to Taco Bell and pick this one up. I'm about six minutes late on it, but hey, I think these people still want their food. You feel me? And I pushed here for pickup. So. Take the next right, then turn right. All right. So I just want to let y'all know okay, I'm here. I'm going to see if they still got this order. Because <laughs> it was only $4.50. I don't do no $4.50. But uh, let me go get this since I messed up. I got to correct my mistakes. Y'all, I just sat in this Taco Bell line for like 10 minutes. I've been here since 6.30. What, 7? It's 6.48. One car took like 10 minutes for an order, man. So this is another thing about these. These these drive-throughs. There ain't no in and out like these other ones, so you gotta kind of map out which stores you can walk in and grab the food versus which ones is drive-throughs. But I text the lady that I'm taking this food to. I told her that they're taking forever in this drive-thru. She said okay. So I didn't miss the order. I'm gonna still get the bread, but it ain't. I ain't doing no more four dollars and nothing, nothing. Trust me, nine dollars and up. That's it. So, yeah. So guess what, y'all? My dumb ass thought it was two different orders when it was one order from one order from two different places is on the right. so now i'm pulling up to the same place the i just requested you leave the order dropped the dairy queen off this they shit's crazy y'all this shit's leave crazy my <laughs> oh my goodness
All right, y'all, so I'm back. I went home, did something real quick, took care of a couple things. But uh, I made more one more run for seven bucks. That got my total up to $37. So from 5.13, and no, I wasn't out from 5.13 till now the whole time. Like I said, I went to the house. I, two hours, I completed five deliveries and 37 bucks um trying to figure out this payout thing they asked me i can get instant payout with a debit card for the doordash or weekly on my bank account i'm thinking weekly i just like to see one big chunk go in instead of every day trying to you know get that all but yeah 37 dollars and um yeah, that was cool. But I log I didn't log out. I pushed in dash because it wouldn't let me do what I was trying to do. So now I'm about to get back out here and get some more. That's it. Dash now. Until nine o'clock. So I'll let y'all know how everything turned out, like I said. But I just wanted to give y'all that update. It's seven forty nine. And, um, yeah, I'll let y'all know what time it is and all that when I'm done and how long it took and how much I made. So, yep. So, the conclusion to my night is, it's 9.14. I did log out for a minute. And then I logged back in. Well, I didn't log out. Is you when you set your times, they uh, have you dashing until that time's up. So I gotta learn to set my times out a little bit further. And um, never drove over seven miles, I would say, out my range of where I'm at. I think the longest delivery was nine miles, no, nine minutes. That was the longest delivery to drive, nine minutes. So, my conclusion on DoorDash is pretty cool. If you want to make you 50, 60, 100 bucks in a couple hours, hey, this is the thing to do it. They shoot it straight to your, uh, straight to your thing. You know, it says done, so I would have to literally go back in. But let, let's see what uh, my earnings is. Let's see, because I know they're going to show me. All right, y'all, so... I finally figured it out. So my total is sixty-seven seventy-five. Active time was two hours and thirty minutes. Dash time was four hours. So that's when I was just sitting around a little bit. Oops, waiting on, you know, something to come through. So I got thirty seventy-five and thirty-seven dollars. Within basically two hours two hours and 30 minutes eight deliveries total so hey i'm not mad at that i'll let y'all know how it goes tomorrow what's tomorrow i think thursday today's wednesday the 19th so we'll let you know what tomorrow looks like and we'll probably go a little you know it's my first day my very first day so just getting accustomed to it so yeah i like it so far and uh you know shit 60 times 31 or 30 is 1800 dollars. just to let y'all know so i'm gonna definitely try to hit that hundred dollar mark every day and see if i can make me about three grand a month in a couple hours a day so y'all stay tuned i'll keep y'all up to date like subscribe to my channel you know, I hope I gave y'all a little bit of some good information, some good uh, tips and all that on what I did. So, yeah. Y'all tap in back in with me tomorrow, and we're going to keep this ball rolling. We out. Yeah.